hello everyone and happy saturday today little prince is going to have his first changing i'm going to change him into something very simple a onesie he's going to wear this onesie by cardis in the three month size and it's gray and has all the different um what do we call these again pirates all the different pirates yeah a nautical i guess it's like a nautical theme with all the different pirates yeah so he's going to wear that and seeing that the colors are gray and navy he's going to wear this gray and navy striped socks to accessorize that and I'm going to put him on a plain sleeveless onesie also in the three month size I do have some newborn size that I wanted to try on him but to find those right now you know I'm pretty sure those are at the bottom of Dyson's pile and that's a lot of work to get to that right now so yeah and in terms of diaper I'm going to try these Looney Tone diapers or um, probably the size two by Pampers. Yeah, probably between those. All right. So I went ahead and I added his ID bracelet. This is nine to five sterling silver ID bracelet. Very, very cute. And if anybody's interested, I had purchased that from eBay. The price was very, very, um, very good I think I paid like maybe $11 yeah that's a really good price for solid sterling silver so I'm gonna go ahead and change him and again uh, he is the Phoenix kit by Andrea Arcello and his name is Princeton Jerome and he's my little prince so his nickname is Prince. So I hope everyone is having a great day. I know the theme for today is PJ Saturday. But um, even though my room is cool, outside is pretty hot. So I decided to um, yeah, just do the onesie. So here's my big boy. And again, um, I did mention briefly yesterday in his box opening that he is the full body vinyl so um i did want to share as much as i can of his body i'm gonna go ahead and change his pampas i see miss beverly has him in a size one so he can wear size one so let me see okay let me try the lonely torn pampas on him yeah, this is this runs pretty narrow. Runs pretty narrow. I think I'll just go and try the size two. Let me try the size two. Size two. Yeah, let me go ahead and try this one. Okay, size two, I can see that size two <laughs> is a bit big for him. Yeah. Um, I wanted to go ahead and add one of these scented wavers in his diaper. So I'm gonna go ahead and add this. And I notice, like normally I don't wrap the little scented thingy. But I'm going to go ahead and wrap it because I don't want it laying directly on his, on his vinyl body. So I'm going to go ahead and um, yeah, wrap it. Yeah. And I'm just going to go ahead and just put it on the inside. Okay, so I took a few pictures of him naked. <laughs> that I plan to share on Instagram. I don't think that Instagram has a problem 
showing vinyl baby pots. I don't think so. So I took some pictures just to show what his body looks like. All right, so he's wearing the size two diaper and I can see that size two runs a bit big. So size one, I'm guessing would be his perfect fit in, in uh, Pampas. Next is his onesie. Yeah, I was too lazy to look up the newborn size onesies because that would be in Dyson's sta uh, stash and that's I had showed my nursery and but it's at the very bottom of the pile. I have to be mentally prepared to actually like move everything. I do plan to eventually get some containers. Now I'm not sure how long I'm going to keep him in the vinyl body because I do like the cuddle feel. Like he, he is, um, I can tell you the vinyl body makes them a lot heavier. Yeah, he's pretty heavy. But I do like the vinyl body, I do. In fact, I was thinking about putting McQuell's body back on. Actually, today is McQuell's first birthday. So I'm going to need to make a video for McQuell. So that would probably be my next video. But I really just wanted to change this little guy so I can become familiar with his size. Okay, I can see that this onesie is a little big, but it's fine. Okay, let me see. And I have to get used to his hair because his, his hair dries out. So I'm going to have to keep moisturizing it by spraying water on it. Let me go ahead and add it. I know what I noticed because he and also Araya has the same sculptor, Andrea Arcello. I noticed that they have similar feet. Like um, this particular feet, Araya's feet is very, very similar. Like where the toes are curved down and the second toe is above the first and third toe. Yeah, I noticed that Araya has, or should I say that the sculptor made their feet basically the same. Yeah, Araya, let me look at Araya's feet. Yeah, on Araya, it's her right feet, and on Prince, it's his left feet. Yeah, I'll show that one day when I have both babies together. Okay. But I noticed that with this kit, you have to be careful. Well, okay, let me go back. This feet, because it's curved up, you have to be careful not to, because you tend to want to bend the feet forward and you have to be careful because of the paint. You don't want to crack the paint. I noticed that like when I pull his feet down a bit, I start to notice like in between if there's a possibility that I can crack his painting and I don't want to do that yeah so it's best to just be careful with this left feet yeah not to mess with that too much okay and now his onesie I think the reason that he can get away wearing like the three months because I thought about it you know his sculptor said newborn size and you know for some persons it depends on what you prefer your babies to wear like what look or fit for me I like a loose fit so I'm guessing that newborn would be really fitted on him because his body is long well the vinyl body that is i'm not i don't know what he would look like with the cloth body except that i'm guessing the cloth body would probably be a little bit smaller but seeing that i like or prefer a loose fit 
I think the, the three months is pretty good. And keep in mind too that some brands run pretty big. Yeah, some brands, like their newborn size, is in between newborn and three months. Like he can wear in between newborn and three months. Yeah, see this fits pretty good. Yes. And another thing too, his, his legs are so far apart that whatever pants he wears you need that extra room to accommodate how wide his legs are open like he has this bow legs yeah so his legs are not straight see if it was straight then he can probably get away wearing a newborn size pants but because his legs are so uh, far apart or, or that he's so bow legged that the three months I, I'm guessing would fit him much more comfortably and you never know maybe well a six month size may be a little bit too too big but i think the three months will of work because his leg is pretty like he's very bow leg as you can see yeah all right so let me go ahead and um let me go ahead and spray his hair yeah like i said his hair is going to take me a while to get used to for now what I do is I just spray it with water only and just scrunch his curls back in I find that his hair gets dry I'm pretty sure I will brush it out one day but for now I'm just trying to get used to his hair being curly. Yeah. But he is such a sweet baby boy. I must say, if there's anyone that is considering getting the Phoenix kit, I would say go for it. Don't hesitate. Just go for it. Beautiful kit. Beautiful kit. Okay, let me just go ahead and um, my daughter is in my bedroom again. Say hello, sweetie. Hi. <laughs> okay, sweetie, you rock in this chair. I can hear you rock in this chair. Mm -hmm. She's been watching movies and she just loved this room. watching movies and on her cell phone and just makes herself comfortable here okay now I've already noticed that I'm going to have to purchase him his own collection of pacifiers because I got this navy but I noticed that it, it, it fits a little bit up too high to his nose yeah and i'm pretty sure that's because of where his magnet is placed so i'm going to have to um purchase him his own collection of pacifiers but see like i said um this is a three month size and it fits him pretty good it's loose but it's fine it's not like he's drowning in it yeah and his limbs are so chunky that it all looks proportionate yes so that's my big guy prince princeton jerome and again i gave him both my father and grandfather's name yeah he's a special guy he is a special guy so i hope everyone enjoy his first changing video and next i'm going to have to make a video with mcwell is actually McQuell's first birthday yes but I really do love his curly hair I do it looks like all I really need to do is just wet it and scrunch it and the curls come right back in I'm gonna dry it dries curl but you know it has that 
dry look and I prefer a moist look and I really don't want to purchase any like moisturizer because like one or two persons mentioned in their video that you know those hair products you know if they drain on their paint it can cause their paint to fade or they can lose paint so I, I you know I prefer to just stick with the water yeah so that's my big guy so also you know what I was thinking about doing is uploading a few of my videos on to Instagram and um, yeah I'm gonna try that I, I will continue on YouTube of course but um, I do want to try you know a little bit of Instagram yeah because I do have a few followers and uh, I've actually been watching a few persons videos on Instagram yeah so that's everyone that's it everyone for my big guy Princeton Jerome I hope you all enjoyed his first changing video oh he's such a sweetie pie he's such a sweetie pie so thank you all so much for watching and you have a great day bye bye